job, all right. I've hardly seen him since the rally. They watched me so carefully, and he's waited, or so his letters say. Our families won't let us out. And then all that business with Aunt Catherine and my cousins. Oh, you saw the house. And then Lee Gray and those boys killed. I had so much bloodshed. I, I, you'd think this could be a new beginning, but everyone left alive. They're even more angry. Maybe anger's a complicated thing to let go of. Something good has to come out of this awful, awful feud. That's what I've been hoping. Bo and I have to be better. Our families were here for years and years. Sometimes I feel like we can't just leave death and, and pain and ruination behind us. Plenty before you have. Plenty will again. But, yeah. As far as it goes, get out. Don't look back. Make something decent of your lives. He's a good man, isn't he? Bo. There are worse. He's kind and he's caring and he's strong. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to laugh. He, he's a lot of things, but. <laughs> there he is. Oh, it's him. Will you ride on the train with us a little, just to the first stop? <sighs> Fine. I caught some reprobate shambling around my backyard. Straight to the wall, I swear, this place is going straight to hell. You came! <laughs> you came! One last, you came! Oh, Bo, oh. my sweet, my best of men. <laughs> oh, I'm hardly a man at all. But I love you, Penelope Braithwaite. Oh, sir, how can we ever repay your kindness? Mm, some of them jewels would do just fine. Bo, Arthur's gonna join us. I think we need the support. Please, could you buy the tickets, dear Mr. Morgan? We, we can't chance being seen. Sure. Thank you. We'll meet you on the platform. <clears throat> Can I have three tickets to San Denis, please, sir? Of course. <sighs> Oh, hello, sir. Hello, Alden. I hope all is well. Uh, not terribly, but good to see you. Hey, cousin. No, hey, no, you uh, slow. Uh, Penelope, get back. Uh, excuse me, Alden. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Get on the train. Get your bags, miss. I got this. Come here, Yankee. With pleasure, you goddamn fool. I want to come back here without giving you a whipping. We should have done this last time. Get on the train, Bob. Go to your wallet. Four fists and maybe one brain between you. You're going to get hurt, cowboy. Get him, Scott. One of you hit me, damn it. Come on, Arthur. If that is his real name. Doesn't matter, he can fight! Oh! Arthur, come on! Oh, no. oh, now there's only one of you! You Arthur! Here. Please get on! Goodbye, Rhodes! Hello, future! Almost! Almost. <sighs> Alright, all done. That is quite a family you got there, son. I know. Charming to the last. Then again, my uncle used to keep his own half-brother as a slave, so what do you expect? Good manners? My uncle used to say things were better the way they were when he could rape and kill with impunity, and he didn't have to work a day in his life. Both our families. There's good people in this county, but our families bullied them and drove most of them off. Whites as well as blacks, all over this silly feud. Yeah, well... How to life. Oh, my lord. What? Oh, I think it's my second cousin. What is with it with all these goddamn cousins? I think they found out about the jewels. All right, keep your heads down. I'll deal with this. Jewels? I knew you had some. Damn jewels. They're coming from over the hill. You must have all the jewels in the state. The amount of your cousins is here.
I knew you had some damn jewels. They're coming from over the hill. You must have all the jewels in the state. They... Is that the driver? He's abandoning us. Old Todd, all right. I'll take a look up front. What will you do? I'll figure it out. Driver, driver, we're in the clear. Time to start this train again. Damn it, you did run. Remind me to rob your trains, mister. <laughs>